Hello everyone, hope you had a nice short break before we're back in class again here. Uh, my name is Brian Kwan. Um, my pronouns are he, him, his. Um, I saw some familiar names out there on the class roster, so it'd be good to talk to everyone again. Um, this is more or less going to be my third semester in the MLIS program. Um, this class will actually be exactly halfway once I'm done. I'm doing the archives and digital curation track. Um, yeah, so that's where we are with that. Um, what brought me to the program? Uh, strangely, uh, this is a second career for me. Um, I was reading in the author notes of a book about uh, his experience at the New York Public Library and the Special Collections reference staff and how much they helped him writing this book. and. That sounded like something I would be very good at. I love reference type of work, and I thought I could be really good in that role, helping other people do their research. So that's that's um, sort of my goal, where that takes me exactly in the field. I don't know yet. Hoping the program will tell me a little bit more about that. Um, let's see, I was born in Fredericksburg, Virginia, so I'm fairly close to being local. Um, I went to school at University of Virginia, graduating in 2001. Um, in the intervening years, I was a professional brewer for 11 years, um, amongst other things, most recently at DC Brow. Um, yeah, I um, live in DC, I'm in Petworth. Um, it's pretty close to campus, but I'm um, still paying out of state tuition, unfortunately. Uh, I've got two cats, they're about 13 years old and they are still loud and refuse to grow old and quiet. Um, my wife and I just celebrated our ninth wedding anniversary last week, so um, that's a little bit on me personally. My field study will be um, working with the Historical Society of Washington, which as some of you may know from the news, they just um, reopened. Um, after a bit of a hiatus in the Carnegie Library, which is a beautiful old building, uh, Mount Vernon Square in DC. Um, it's also the building where Apple is. So their new uh, store is in the first floor and um, the DC History Center is on the second floor. Um, so it's Apple money that has helped us <laughs> renovate the place and make it look beautiful again after 120 years. Um, at the moment, the collections for HSW are still off-site. We are working to get the temperature and humidity controls where we want them before we bring the stuff back over. So the museum has a lot of our stuff at the moment and various other storage facilities. Um, so until we get the library open, my job is kind of helping facilitate the move. Um, we have some software that we've input the measurements of all the boxes and the stuff that we have off-site and we've measured all the new shelving units and the dimensions of each and where we can put these things. So I've been uh, making shelf liners and measuring shelves and taping up signs so the movers know where the boxes will go when they come back in. That's what I've been doing. I've been there for three weeks already, I should say that. Um, working three days a week, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Um, I started the day after classes ended, so I've already been there for three weeks. Um, the move of most of our materials are, is supposed to occur next week. Um, once that happens, we'll get everything set up um, in the library, and then I will be working the reference desk there uh, with the reference librarian. And um, a big thing that HSW does is like house history. So we have a lot of old atlases for DC real estate, so people can look up the history of their house and things like that. It's very interesting to me as well, looking at old maps and things. Um, aside from that, there's going to be some educational type of stuff. I know there are a couple of grades of DC public schools that come through uh, to learn about DC history, so I will be a part of that as well. Um, yeah, so I am looking forward to it. I am looking forward to talking with everyone else in the class about their intern their field studies internships. So. Um, yeah, I will sign off here. Cheers. Have a good weekend.